The Dismet Spartan Football Legacy. It's more than a 2005 state championship title. It's more than being a top-ranked team year after year. It's more than being a consecutive state semifinalist in the playoffs. It's even more than producing some of the most memorable and talented athletes the state of Missouri has ever seen. What makes this legacy a long, established, and inherited way of thinking? It's the circular leadership model. A tradition of excellence. The attitude of winners. The soul of champions. And the spirit of the Spartan warrior. A number of years ago, we, after the movie 300 Spartans came in, we used their the mantra there about their the soldier to the right of you and the soldier to the left of you are, are your responsibilities. And out of that, Robert Steeples actually, I think, penned it. Robert Steeples went back to the Rudyard Kipling uh, poem, Jungle Book, and uh, this is the law of the jungle. Using uh, the mantra that came from the movie 300 Spartans, he wrote uh, what we say before we go out, and that is you know, just quite simply the, the ethos of the entire chant is real simple, that we're going to give everything we have to each other so at the end of the game there's nothing left. It's either everything or it's nothing. Don't enter the arena unless you are willing to give everything that you have for the teammate that's standing to the right of you and to the left of you. It is the law of the Spartan and the creed that this football team lives by. And this law is chiseled into the memory of every Spartan just as they exit the locker room before a game. The Law of the Spartan Huddle is a time when our whole team comes together and gets prepared for a game. And I don't feel, none of us feel ready for the game until that moment happens. It lets us know that we have teammates to our left and our right that we can count on in tough times in the game and the good times. When I experienced the Law of Spartan for the first time, I felt I was ready, ready for the game and that I knew I had my teammates back and they had my back. The Law of the Spartan is something that every kid who walks through the locker room has to embrace. The law of the Spartan is the truth, absolute truth. If I'm not out there doing what I have to do, I'm hurting my, my team and I'm hurting my chances to win. It gets us all focused as a team and prepares us for what we have in front of us. Like, it's just like a battle cry, like getting us ready for the game. In this together, you know, we're going to go out there and fight with each other. You know, we're going to go out there and battle. We got each other back and we're not going to put each other down. My favorite part of a lot of the Spartan is the Spartan that keeps it must prosper and the Spartan that breaks it must die. That's my favorite part because no matter who you are, whether you're the youngest guy on the team or whether you're that five-star athlete, we all in this together to become one. My favorite part is the strength of Spartan. It's the pack and it's my favorite part because it shows that alone we can lose, but together we're stronger. It's, you know, my everything or nothing. Basically saying like, you know, you're gonna give your everything when you get out there for your team, you're going to leave it all out on the field like is it, as if it was your last game. My favorite part of the Law of the Spartan is when we do my everything or nothing because it's the most intense part and it's the most emotional part. This law is more than the governing code that they live by. It is the backbone for the Spartan survival. This is the Law of the Jump! This is the Law of the Jump! It's the oldest truth in the sky! It's the oldest truth in the sky! And that Spartan that keeps them prosperous! The Spartan keeps them prosperous! And that Spartan that breaks them must die! And the Spartan that breaks them must die! Embrace it, they fight for it, and cannot win without it. The Law of the Spartan.